Uh, hello friends, today in this tutorial I will be talking about a open source image processing library which is called as Image Magic. So basically if you go to Google here and uh, if you type Image Magic, the very first result which comes up you need to click on that imagemagic.org. This is the official website of the library. It has a command line tool also and you can just download it for the windows. If you go to the site, I have given the link in the description. This is the dll.exe file for 32 bit or 64 bit. I have a 64 bit computer. I have already downloaded this file. Very simple setup process is there. Click next, 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 and you will uh, install this. And after installing it, you just need to go to command line. And if you type the command gm, gm starts, uh, stands for graphic graphics magic if you type this command you will have these options of appearing so in this specific video we will be talking about this uh, convert option that you can just apply to it so if you type here gm dash convert you will have some options that you can apply all these options that you can just apply on these images you can convert from one image to another you can crop the image you can magnify the image all that stuff you can do from the single library so basically I have a images directory opened here let me just show you and one single PNG file is there inside this and I have opened uh, this directory inside my command line you can see that and the very basic operation that you can do with this library in order to convert this PNG file into JPG file what you can do here is that you can just write GM after that you can just apply a flag which is dash convert and uh, then you will be supplying your input file which is image.png and then you will be writing your output file so in this case we need to convert the png into jpg so we will write here image.jpg enter and now it will create this jpg file and now guys you can see that the size difference also the png file the original file was 2 megabytes and it has compressed this image and converted this into jpg and it has reduced the size to 120 kb KB. Now if I open this image you will see that no uh, no quality has been compromised and yet the image is reduced to 120 kilobytes. So you can just use this library very efficient library you can use in, in programming applications if you want to build this in uh, Node.js also. If you want to integrate with Node.js there is a sp separate Node.js module which is there you can use it let me just show you. If you type here Node.js image magic and if you you can see that this is a module guys you can see that this is a module node image magic you can just download this module and various more other modules are also available so let me just uh, show you the other module that is available if you go to the site here this site let me just show you uh, this one uh, this is uh, GM version 1.9.0 this is a library that guys uh, npm install gm gm stands for graphic magic and this is the library i'm talking about all the functions are there that you can apply on this uh, using this library is there is in uh, node.js and let me just show you one two or two three functions more uh, that you can apply here let me just show you how to magnify image let's suppose if you want to magnify a image let's suppose I need to magnify this PNG image which is a flower which is uh, let's suppose it has a dimensions let me just show you 1644 width and 1562 height I need to magnify it I need to double its size I can just pass this magnify flag here and after that we just need to give it a uh, a value let's suppose I need to magnify double I will pass here 2 that's it and now I will be providing the output file name which is image2m.png if I enter it it will be doubling its dimensions in both width and height and just wait it is converting that so it takes some time so it is saying that no such file is there let me just again type the command which is gm-convert the original file name is image.png and then you just need to apply the flag which is dash magnify to image to m.png let me just write this and once again convert this
In similar manner, guys, you can see that it has created this file image 2m and now it has doubled this dimensions 3288 and 3124. And in similar manner, guys, you can just create some more files. You can see that uh, if you want to, let's suppose, let me just show you. If you want to apply a border, let's suppose, to an image, you can just specify the width and the height of the border in this manner. And I will be creating this output file border.png. If I enter this command, now it will create, add a border to it. So just wait. So this library is very useful if you want to add. Now it has successfully created that file and let me just open this. This is a border.png file. If I open this, it will have created a border. You will see that. Now it has created a border here of this width and height. And uh, in this manner, guys, you, you can just uh, have apply more operations like contrast, you can increase the brightness of the image, all that stuff you can do with this graphics magic library. So thanks very much for watching this video.